Have you heard of the rule of seven? This is one you won't want to miss. The rule of seven is a simple financial concept that helps you estimate how long it will take for your money to double, based on a given interest rate or rate of return. To use the rule of seven, you divide the number seven by the interest rate or rate of return expressed as a percentage. The result is the number of years it will take for your money to double. For example, if you have an investment that earns 7% interest per year, you would divide 7 by 7, which equals 1. This means that it would take approximately 1 year for your money to double. Here's another example. If you have an investment that earns 10% interest per year, you would divide 7 by 10, which equals 0.7. This means that it would take approximately 7 years for your money to double. The rule of 7 is based on the concept of compounding interest. Compounding is when you earn interest not only on your original investment but also on the interest earned from previous periods. This can result in exponential growth of your investment over time, as your interest earns interest. It's important to keep in mind that the rule of 7 is just an estimate and that actual results may vary based on market conditions and other factors. It's also important to consider any fees, taxes, and inflation when evaluating the potential return on your investments. Taking for example the S&P 500 which is a stock market index that tracks the performance of 500 large companies listed on stock exchanges in the United States. Historically, the S&P 500 has delivered an average long-term return of around 9-10% to per year, when adjusted for inflation. It's important to note that this is an average return and that actual returns can vary widely from year to year or even over longer periods. Additionally, past performance does not guarantee future results, and investing in the stock market carries risks, including the potential loss of principal. Investors should consider their individual investment goals, risk tolerance, and time horizon when deciding whether to invest in the stock market or other investment vehicles. They may also want to consult with a financial advisor to determine the best investment strategy for their unique circumstances. The amount of time it takes to double your investment return depends on the rate of return you earn and the power of compounding. You can use the rule of 72 as a quick way to estimate how long it will take for your investment to double. To use the rule of 72, simply divide 72 by the rate of return you expect to earn. The result is the approximate number of years it will take for your investment to double. For example, if you expect to earn a 7% annual return on your investment, you can divide 72 by 7, which equals approximately 10.3. This means it would take around 10.3 years for your investment to double. Similarly, if you expect to earn a 10% annual return on your investment, you can divide 72 by 10, which equals approximately 7.2. This means it would take around 7.2 years for your investment to double. It's important to remember that the rule of 72 is just an estimate and that actual results may vary based on market conditions and other factors. Additionally, investing always carries risk and there is no guarantee that any investment will double in value within a specific time frame. This is why starting early can greatly benefit the power of compounding in your investments. Compounding is the process of generating earnings on an investment's reinvested earnings, and it works best when you have time on your side. The longer your investment has to grow, the more time it has to compound, allowing your returns to build on top of each other over time. This means that even small contributions made regularly over a long period can add up significantly, resulting in a larger total return. For example, let's say you invest $1,000 and earn a 7% annual return. After one year, your investment would be worth $1,070. If you leave that money in your investment and earn another 7% return the following year, you would earn $74.90 in interest, bringing your total investment value to $1,144.90. Over time, this compounding effect can lead to significant growth in your investment. Starting early also allows you to take advantage of the power of time in a way that cannot be replicated by increasing the amount you invest later. Even if you invest a larger amount later in life, the time for compounding to work its magic will be shorter, limiting the potential for growth.